My testimony starts when I was 16 years old. Um, coming to this church has really been the greatest blessing of my life. Um, right, right before we came, I've gone through basically the biggest tragedy that I'd ever experienced. Um, my parents had divorced a couple years later. Um, my dad suddenly passed away from cancer, so totally unexpected. My whole life was uprooted, and um, I, I moved in with my mom. We reconciled our relationship, and then she said she's been coming to this church called The River, and uh, did I feel like, you know, I wanted to go, and then did we want to move down here, pray about moving down here? And so we came. I avoided the youth group and um, and I just kind of stayed in the main services, but God was pulling on my heart and uh, I came over to the youth group one night and somebody had heard my, you know, kind of what I had just been through and they said another teenager wanted to um, sponsor me to go to their summer camp that was coming up. And so, um, so I said, oh no, I don't really want to go. But anyway, I ended up going and thankfully I did and I came and the summer camp was amazing. I mean, completely changed my life. It's literally exactly what we do here in the, the Youth Fire Weeks, but I came to the summer camp and I got filled with the Holy Ghost for the first time and the love of God was poured on me because I was in such a broken place, you know, just everything I had experienced as a kid. And then in my teenage years, um, I was just dealing with so much brokenness and heaviness. And I came to that summer camp and, and it's like the Lord just started lifting off the burdens that, you know, that I was carrying. I didn't even know I was carrying. And I remember kind coming one particular night that um, Pastor Allen was preaching and actually he hadn't even gotten to preach. They just did worship and he started um, praying for people and I was standing towards the back of the room and he prayed for me. <laughs> I hit the floor and I started laughing <laughs> and I got totally filled with joy. <laughs> and what was so cool was I was starting to see like all these things I had gone through like bad things I had gone through. And I realized later, like God was detaching the, the hurt and the pain from the memory. And I laid on that floor and I laughed and I didn't, I had never really understood, you know, I'd never really seen that before. I didn't think I would ever do that. And I laid there and I laughed. And when I got off the floor, I was so happy. <laughs> and I was like, I was looking around, I'm like, man, the trees are so green and the sky is so blue. And uh, it's like it's like Jesus just lifted this heavy burden off of me. And I remember thinking like, I mean, life is just so good like this. How could you ever go back? And so um, right after that, I knew that God called me into Bible school. And uh, I knew how to call a God in my life. I didn't know where I wanted to go to school. So I knew now, obviously, the Lord set me up to go to this Bible school, to go to River University. I went and then uh, just following that, I, I met my husband, Ryan, and then um, we came and, and we became part of this ministry um, as pastoral staff in 2019. And the Lord, um, you know, it's it's amazing because I get to share this testimony every single month with the healing school and everywhere that we've traveled to, I get to share this testimony of what God did in my life. So the blessing that God did for me with lifting that heavy burden off me, you know, it's like you can, I, I've watched people how, how how God sets them free just in an instant when they hear, you don't have to carry that burden anymore. You, you know, the joy of the Lord is for you. You can be free. You don't have to be depressed. You know, God gives you the oil of joy instead of mourning and the garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness. And so if you're watching this video and you know, you've been through something, you've been through something horrendous maybe in your childhood, in your past, God wants to give you that supernatural joy. It's for you. It's for everybody watching this. It's not just for the extroverted personality, but God wants to give you that joy so that he can make you a conduit of it, so that he can take you places, and then God will use your life to set others free just like he's done for me. So if he's done it for me, he'll do it for you. God wants to fill you with joy. He wants to make you a blessing to your generation. I know God's going to use many, many people that are watching this video in Jesus' name. Amen.